This is a J Mix exclusive. Okay, here's a quick video to respond to Reggie Wright Jr.'s comments on his new Bomb First interview. So, check it out. Around 9.30, he starts bringing up the Ken Knox report. And when I asked him in our uh, interview slash conversation slash debate, whatever you want to call it, about Ken Knox, Reggie Wright Jr. denies ever talking to Ken Knox. And he basically says that, you know, to produce the paperwork. It's at the 9.30 mark of this video. So what I'm doing right now is I'm producing the paperwork. What you're going to see is the cover sheet to the Ken Knox files and the excerpt of the Ken Knox files that allude to Reggie Wright Jr. trying to get Suge Knight's bail revoked. And I will let you see for yourself. I recommend everybody go check out bombfirst.com's interview with Reggie Wright that they just put out. And I'll let you guys be the judge. One love, everybody. You didn't want to see Shug go to prison on a parole violation? No, I didn't. No. I why, did you, why did you make a report to Kenneth hey, Knox? Huh? You made a, real quick, you made a report to Kenneth Knox um, that Shug was hanging around armed felons in order to get his that parole was, violated. That wasn't me that made that, that statement. I was Ken, they always said the studio manager. I wasn't the studio manager. Kevin Lewis was the studio manager. He was the one that was talking. I never met Kevin Knox or Kenneth Knox in my life. I don't even know who that is. They always got me mixed up with Kevin Lewis. Kevin Lewis is the one that knew him because he got assaulted and beat up at the back of the studio. And that's when he developed that relationship. If you look into it and investigate it more, you'll see the person that was talking to him was Kevin Lewis, who was the studio manager. This is a J Mix exclusive. What up, Rashad?